Got my bank papers, passport, student ID book, and admission notice. Last night, I lost my bank card somewhere. I maybe 18 hours, and there's also really no stop sign on this kid. You can get hit by a bicycle at any time. Here we can get my debit card replaced. I just got my waiting ticket. Just got out of the bank and it looks like I'm really stupid. It will some for some reason take two weeks to get a new bank card. The bank teller suggested that I go move money to my student card so I can get food, but Chinese banks don't actually hand out money. When I asked if I could just withdraw money in person, they're like, oh we don't do that, you have to use an ATM. But because you don't have a debit card, you can't use the ATM. I can't believe I lost my card. Just got some lunch and I got a uh, tofu skin or Calvin, would you say in Chinese tofu pea or something or dou? Yeah, I would call it snake skin, bro. Snake skin, yeah, it's kind of bumpy. <laughs> yeah, it's kind of bumpy. My name is Kelvin and I'm from Western Australia. Why did you come to Beijing? Why did you come to Tsinghua? I wanted to feel closer to my home. And I like rice. <laughs> and I want to learn the culture of Beijing. Um, and I want to speak the language. I'm like a closeted, uh, nerd anime person. We have little parties where like we all watch Okugeki no <gasps> Soma. No way! Yeah. I have to watch that myself. I study pharmaceutical sciences, but I am in the School of Economics and Management here. Which is pretty cool. Any cool courses? Corporate strategy management. I like the teacher. Mm. I met a lot of Americans there. What's your impression of us? Very well traveled. Really? Yeah. Not like the ignorant um, Americans that I met in Thailand. It, they were from um, Florida State University. One was a teacher, one was a um, telecommunicator. All good things. Except they asked me where I was from, I'm like Australia. And they're like, then why are you Asian? I'm just like, so stunned. <laughs> so I, I proceeded pretty... to explain to them that I immigrated there. I thought I was like an asylum seeker or something. But he's been trying like literally everything. Even like black fungus, which I think we all kind of agree that was pretty horrible. <laughs> Looks like this group of Aussies is trying to head to some fragrant hills place. Let's check it out. You're 40 minutes from campus. We're at some rural uh, stop. Just say you like We grabbed a nice sweet potato. And they've got some very, they've got some very colorful looking snacks. This one's really good. Dried that, pear. Dried pear. That, that, like actually, I'd apple. be down for that. What's oh, that? Lemons? Hey, this is Jiang Ma. Try the dried lemons. Can I? I'll, I'll, I'll buy some with you. I think, I think it's ginger though. Get in here. Yo. <laughs> Me, well, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, boy. 
No, yeah. yeah. Some kind of communist poster, I think, right? I don't know. <laughs> Caught my ticket to Fragrant Hills. I found the Great Wall. Cemetery. I can, I, I... <laughs> oh. No, go up, go higher. Oh, I'm like Oh look, it's Chinese graffiti. Where I go to escape the struggles of uh, modern life. <laughs> Just life, yeah. back from uh, Shangshan, the fragrant hills. I, I had a good time, some really pretty sights. Uh, though, you know, I kind of feel like I'm not the tourist type. I really did enjoy trying some of the street food, so there might be more coming. Me and a friend are gonna try and plan some trip where we check out like eight to 10 different street foods and I'll stick them all in a video. So right now I am struggling to figure out how the washing machine works. I have put my clothes in, so that's a, that is a start. Other than pressing this power button right here. I have literally no idea how I'm supposed to get the thing to start spinning. There's some buttons up here. Oh, shit. Oh no. It's just the power. I did not think to read the instructions. So. I needed some funky little video chip. I just swiped on the machine. It just looks dead. Is it gonna start? Oh. Oh. What's popping, bro? Come on, start it up, bro. Beep, beep. Okay, well, my clothes are getting wet. I honestly have no idea what else I'm supposed to do. Okay, maybe it's just doing its thing. Let's do its magic and come back in half an hour. I thought that I was just unphotogenic until one day I just realized I was ugly. <laughs> First step of fixing any problem is accepting it. I'm not sure where step two goes. Step two is cry. <laughs>